It's Lana Dwayne Bathu Bay. Um, and my highest self. It is February the 2nd, 2019. I'm Rhonda Arrington Hyphen Bay. Now I'm going to read um, chapter 2 of the Holy Quran. Uh, continuing, I'm rereading. I've already read this chapter before, but I'm rereading it. Um, continuing with section 5. And um, I'll probably read section 5. And I'll decide where I stop. This is called Israelite Prophecies Fulfilled in Quran. O children of Israel, call to mind my favor which I bestow on you and be faithful to your and this is verse 40 to your covenant with me I shall fulfill my covenant with you and me me alone should you fear and believe in that which I have revealed verifying that which is with you and be not the first Islam, Islam, Islam. I'm going to start again. I'm going to read. I have to start off with the opening. The opening, um, which is the Fatiha. El Fatiha. In the name of Allah. The Beneficent, the Merciful. Praise be to Allah, the Lord of the worlds, the Beneficent, the Merciful, Master of the Day of Requital. Thee do we serve and thee do we beseech for help. Guide us on the right path, the path of those upon whom thou hast bestowed favors, not those upon whom wrath is brought down nor those who go astray islam i mean so now i'm going to go back to section two section four and five i mean chapter two section four and five and once again i'm rereading which is good Like I was on the wrong. Um, hold on. Forty. Oh, okay. It's not. I started off wrong. Um, wait a minute. Oh, excuse me. It's five and six. Section five and six. Um, chapter two, the cow. Starting continuing section five and six. Israelites' prophecy fulfilled in the Quran. O children of Israel, call to my favor which I bestow on you and be faithful to your covenant with me. I should fulfill my covenant with you and me, me alone, should you fear and believe in that which I have revealed, verifying that which is with you and be not the first to deny it. Neither take a mean price for my messages and keep your duty to me me alone and mix not up truth with falsehood nor hide the truth while you know Islam keep and keep up prayer and pay the poor rate Islam and bow down with those who bow down do you enjoy men to be good and neglect your own souls while you read the book have you then no sense and seek assistance through patience and prayer and this is hard except for the humble ones who know that they will meet their Lord and that to him they will return O children of Israel, 
call to mind my favor which I bestowed on you and that I made you excel the nations and guard yourselves against a day when no soul will avail another in the least neither will intersection be accepted on its behalf nor will compensation be taken from it nor will they be helped and when we deliver you from Pharaoh's people who subjected you to severe torment killing your sons and sparing your women and in this there was there was a great trial from your Lord and when we parted the sea for you so we saved you and drowned the people of Pharaoh while you saw and when we appointed a time of 40 nights with Moses then you took the calf for a God after him and you were unjust then we pardon you after that so that you might give thanks and when we gave Moses the book and the discrimination that you might walk aright and when Moses said to his people oh my people you have surely wronged yourselves by taking the calf for God so turn to your creator penitently, penitently, and kill your passions. That is best for you with your creator. So he turned to you mercifully. Surely he is the off returning to mercy, the merciful. And when you said, Moses, and when you said, O oh Moses, we will not believe in thee till we see Allah manifestly. So the punishment overtook you while you looked on. Then we raised you up after your stupor that you might give thanks. And we made the clouds to give shade over you. And we sent to you manna and quails. Eat of the good things that we have given you. And they did not so, uh, and they did not do us any harm, but they wronged their own souls. Let me read that again. And we made the clouds to give shade over you, and we sent to you manna and quails. Eat of the good things that we have given you and they did not do us any harm but they wronged their own souls and we said enter this city that eat from it a plenteous food which you wish enter the gates submissively and make petition for forgiveness we will forgive you your wrongs and increase the reward of those who do good to others but those who were unjust changed the word which had been spoken to them for another saying so we sent upon the wrongdoers a pestilence from heaven because they transgressed. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and read chapter se I mean section 7 as well. It's called Divine Favors on Israel, Israel. And when Moses prayed for water for his people, we said, march on to the rock with thy staff. So 
there flowed from it 12 springs. Each tribe knew their drinking place. Eat and drink of the provisions of Allah and act not corruptly, making mischief in the land. And when you said, O oh Moses, we cannot endure one food, so pray thy Lord on our behalf to bring forth for us out of what the earth grows of its herbs and its cucumbers and its garlic and its lentils and its onions he said will you exchange that which is better for that which is worse Enter a city, so you will have what you ask for. And abasement and hum humiliation were stamped upon them. And they incurred Allah's wrath. That was so because they disbelieved in the messages of Allah and would kill the prophets unjustly. That was so because they disobeyed and exceeded the limits. Islam. Okay, so that's 11 minutes. Okay, and once again, this is the Holy Quran. Uh, and I read um, chapter 2, the cow. Um, at the beginning, I read the Fataha. And I did section 5 through 7. Now, I'm about to read... Um, Matthew chapter 15. Oh, wait, yeah, 15. Matthew chapter 15 of the um, Holy Bible. Okay. This is the Holy Bible. And I'm going to read chapter 15 of Matthew, the book of Matthew. It says, Then came to Jesus scribes and Pharisees, which were of Jerusalem, saying, Why do the disciples transgress the traditions of the elders? For they wash not their hands when they eat bread. But he answered and said unto them, Why do ye also transgress the, con the commandments of God by your tradition. For God commanded, saying, Honor thy father and mother, and he that cursed father or mother, let him die the death. But ye said, ye say, Whosoever shall say to his father or his mother, it is a gift by Whatsoever thou might be prof profited by me. And honor not his father or his mother. He shall be free. Thus have ye made the commandment of God of none effect by your tradition. Ye hypocrites, well did Esaias prophecy of you, saying, the people draw knee unto me with their mouth and honor me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. But in vain they do worship me, teaching for doctrines the commandments of men. And he called the multitude, and he said unto them, Hear and understand. Not that which goeth into the mouth defiled a man, but that which cometh out of the mouth, this defiled a man. Then came his disciples and said unto him, Knowest thou that the Pharisees were offended after they heard this saying? 
But he answered and said, Every plant which my heavenly Father have not planted shall be rooted up. Let them alone. They be blind leaders of the blind. And if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into the ditch. Then answered Peter and said unto him, Declare unto us this parable. And Jesus said, Are ye also yet without understanding? Do not ye yet understand that whosoever entereth in at the mouth goeth into the belly, and is cast out into the drought? But those things which proceed out of the mouth come forth from the heart, and they defile the man. Islam. For out of the heart proceed evil thoughts, murders, adulteries, fornications, thefts, false witness, blasphemy. These are the things which defile a man. But to eat with unwashing hands defile not a man. Then Jesus went thence and departed into the coast of Tyre and Sidon. And behold, a woman of Canaan came out of the same coast and cried unto him, saying, Have mercy on me, O Lord, thy son of David. My daughter is grievously vexed with a devil. But he answered her not a word. And his disciples came and besought him, saying, Send her away, for she cry after us. But he answered and said, I am not sent but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Then came she and worshipped him, saying, Lord, help me. But he answered and said, It is not meet to take the children's bread and cast it to dogs. And said she, Truth, Lord, yet the dolls eat of the crumbs which fall from their master's table. Then Jesus answered and said unto her, O woman, great is thy faith, but it unto thee even as thou wilt. And her daughter was made whole from that very hour. And Jesus departed from thence and came knee unto the sea of Galilee and went up unto a mountain and sat down thee and sat down there. And great multitudes came unto him, having with them those that were lame blind, dumb, maimed, and many others, and cast them down at Jesus' feet, and he healed them. Insomuch that the multitude wondered, when they saw the dumb to speak, the maimed to be whole, the lame to walk, and the blind to see, and they glorified the God of Israel. Then Jesus called his disciples unto him and said, I have compassion on the multitude because they continue with me now three days and have nothing to eat. And I will not send them away fasting lest they faint in the way. And his disciples said unto him, Whence should we have so much bread in the wilderness? And 
has to feel so great most a great a great a multitude and Jesus said unto them how many loaves have ye and they said seven and a few little fishes and he commanded the multitude to sit down and the ground on the ground and he took the seven loaves and the fishes and gave thanks and break and break them and gave to his disciples and the disciples of the multitudes and of the multitude and they did all eat and were filled and they took up of the broken meat that was left seven basket full and they did and they that did eat were four thousand men besides women beside women and children and he sent away the multitude and took ship and came into the coast of Magdala Islam okay so that's chapter 15 of Matthew Islam and it's February the 2nd 2019 Islam